and good evening. Welcome to my kitchen. This is my other kitchen. This is the kitchen that means so much to me because it's pretty much where I end up after I cooked for people. Now, uh, this video is about, let's just talk about, okay, customers, customer service. Now, I want to know how you feel about, um, there are those customers. Now, we love our customers to death. We actually would have no purpose in our businesses uh, other than being in business for the hell of it, if it wasn't for the customers. So we want to give the customers what they want. 99% of our customers are awesome. Um, there are customers that, that it almost seems like they want to set you up for for failure. Maybe Maybe they've had a bad week or maybe they just are not feeling good about themselves. They need to crush someone. Um, you know, in our industry, everyone does does sometimes make mistakes. You know, we're human. Maybe one day they're going to replace us by robots. You know, hey, it's possible. I've I've seen the uh the the science journals. They can put a car together in under X amount of hours. So so how do you feel about about customers that seem? I'm I'm sure some days it feels like every customer is is against us. Um, but how do you feel about some customers? Which you know we've all had those days where we feel like they're trying to um to set us up for failure. Now, like um you can get personal about it. Uh, I did get personal about it tonight. What do you do? You got to you like like for me, I've taken my personal issue out of it and you know what what the fuck, you know, they just trying to get what they want. Maybe they they they're um trying to have a go at us for the fuck of it. I don't know. Um maybe they're using us as a vehicle to release some some kind of uh, you know dissatisfaction with their lives, but you know I I don't like it. But you know, hey, it is the service industry. You know, sometimes the customers there's a a small percentage that they think we're 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 a notch above or maybe a notch below the old school slaves. You know, so um, that's just me letting it out about an experience that I've had, you know. Yeah, we did fuck up one tiny thing, but then it seemed like they milked it. And you know, I guess they've got the right to milk it. They pay. We're meant to serve. We're meant to give them what they want. And we're only human. Maybe in the old days we would have been, you know. They used they used to um, you know, just, you know, punish people for whatever the fuck reason. Anyway, you're asking yourself, uh, like, like, you're not listening to, you're, you're saying, why has he got two coffee machines? Yes, you know, one was given to me and one I bought. And yes, I know they're not the posh ones because they break and, you know, they get abused. And, you know, sometimes I just want to put it in my boot. And, and those of you that know me that you know I've got a little boot. Um, and that's my share. I know I, I, I'm just sharing more than anything. That's my share on how I feel about customers when they seem to set us up for failure. And, you know, you know, maybe they do. Maybe it's just me. But, you know, some sometimes, you know, the customers are good. You know, 99% of them are fucking good. But, 99, you know, there's that small percentage that have ugly hearts, you know. Um, you know, and that's it. That's me signing off. I just wanted to share that because, you know, some days we do take our, our, um, our, our jobs personally. I mean, we wouldn't be fucking... Um, human if we didn't um, is anyone even watching me I don't know hey leave a comment um, subscribe you're probably in on on, on the on, on the floor you know I know that the, the videos are not the best quality but who gives a fuck uh, I wanted to um, share what I'm feeling at the moment so thank you for watching um, and hey thanks for, for being part of the of, of the ground floor yeah so have a good night